After blocking the game-winning extra point against the Wildcats, ASU finished last season with a 6-6 six six record. Not only did the Sun Devils win the Territorial Cup that night, but that game also served as a showcase for Brock Osweiler. The proof of the world, what kind of football team we are, we never quit. This season, the junior will stake his claim as a starter for this explosive Sun Devil offense. But some wonder if the Montana native is ready to lead this program in the right direction. I hope so. <laughs> Um, no, I mean, I, I feel more confident than I've ever been since I've been here. Just like the offense he runs, Osweiler's newfound confidence is starting to spread. He's a, he's a different guy out there, and, and uh, not only as a quarterback, but as a leader, which to me is a key. He's just stepped up every day and led by example. And when you do that, you know, it's easy to follow him. You know, we see him working hard and getting guys in the weight room, getting guys extra to throw. You know, he's an easy guy to follow when you really want, uh, expect to win games with him. The Sun Devils' last Rose Bowl appearance was in 1997. Now, with that being said, many of the players feel that this team is capable of adding one more trophy to this case. January swag, you know what I mean? Roses, we got to get it. But roses wouldn't be enough for the Sun Devils. Everybody wants to go to the Rose Bowl. I mean, I've been to California. I haven't been to New Orleans yet. And we're not destined for a 7-5 bowl game. Um, we know that this team can do bigger things. For ASU, there is nothing bigger than a championship. From Tempe, Arizona, Isaac Easley, Cronkite Sports.